Welcome to the Science and Materials Laboratory. For today's lesson, we'll be looking at the Corrosion Studies Lab, which involves examining the effect of hydrochloric acid, also known as HCl, and internal stresses on the corrosion rate of aluminum. Corrosion is the deterioration of a material as a result of its reaction with the environment, especially with oxygen. Although the term is usually applied to metals, all materials, including ceramics, plastics, rubber and wood, deteriorates at the surface to some extent when they are exposed to certain combinations of liquids and or gases. We will be using four aluminum samples, an analytical balance, emery sandpaper, a corrosion studies kit, beakers, a vernier caliper and a screwdriver. We will start off by labeling the samples 1S, 2S, 1US, and 2US. The top layer of each sample will then sand down with the emery paper provided. Using the screwdriver provided, samples 1S and 2S were deformed and scraped on the surface. Using a vernier caliper, each sample had its length, width and thickness measured. The weight of each sample was measured using an analytical balance. Samples 1S and 1US were fitted and clamped onto the vessel lid and placed into a vessel. The same was repeated for samples 2S and 2US. One molar HCl solution was added to both vessels up to the point where all metal samples were completely submerged in acid. The corrosion studies kit was then started to bubble air into the vessel for two hours. After two hours, the corrosion studies kit was turned off. All samples were unclamped and removed from the vessels to be washed to remove any loose deposits or acid.
All samples were thoroughly dried using paper towels. Using a vernier caliper, each dried sample had its length, width, and thickness measured. The weight of each sample was measured using an analytical balance.